the healing power of forgiveness. In a small quiet village nestled between towering mountains and lush valleys, lived a wise old saint named Elijah. His wisdom was known far and wide, and people from surrounding villages often came seeking guidance. However, his heart carried a hidden turmoil, a thorny secret that was etched deep into his soul, an unresolved conflict with his estranged brother, Isaac. Isaac and Elijah were sons of the village's most respected healer. Growing up, they were the best of friends, sharing dreams, secrets, and laughter, till one fateful day, friendship turned into rivalry. Triggered by a misunderstanding over their father's property, Isaac and Elijah's bond transformed into bitterness, tearing them apart. Isaac left the village, and with him, a piece of Elijah's soul. As the years passed, the wound of their separation festered, turning into a labyrinth of suffering for Elijah. It was a path of unforgiveness he tread upon each day, accompanied by remorse and sorrow. His warmth, once radiant, was now dimmed by the shadow of resentment. One day, a luminary monk, revered as Master Ming, visited their village. He had heard tales about the wise old saint, and the maze of torment he was lost in. With profound empathy, he approached Elijah and asked, Why does a man of wisdom choose to endure instead of escape? Elijah, touched by the monk's perception, shared his tale of pain and remorse. Master Ming listened attentively and then spoke in a serene tone, Elijah, carrying the burden of resentment won't take you anywhere. May I tell you a secret? Elijah nodded. There is only one key to release you from this prison of suffering, forgiveness. But how can I forgive Isaac? He wronged me. The wound is deep, and the pain immense, Elijah countered. Master Ming replied, forgiveness isn't about the other person. It's a gift you give yourself. It's the path of emotional liberation. It's a way to melt your icy heart and allow love and peace to bloom. Your pain is the labyrinth, and forgiveness is the escape. Although moved by Master Ming's words, Elijah found it hard to embrace their truth. Over the following days, however, the concept of forgiveness started to unfurl in his mind, like a delicate spring bud. He started meditating on it, understanding its significance, and slowly, he felt an unfamiliar warmth kindling in his heart. A few days later, he heard that Isaac was passing through their village, and without a second thought, Elijah decided to meet him. Seeing his brother after many decades brought back echoes of their shared past. He saw his brother's hardened visage, but behind it he saw the same troubled eyes that reflected his own torment. With tears streaming down his face, Elijah embraced his brother. I forgive you Isaac, and I ask for your forgiveness too. Our estrangement has caused us both unfathomable pain. I release us from this labyrinth of suffering. Isaac, taken aback by his brother's words, broke down. In the silence that followed, they both found solace and the beginning of healing. Elijah's heart was surging with a joy he hadn't felt in decades. It was as if the labyrinth had dissolved, replaced by a flowering meadow. The wise saint realized the true power of forgiveness and how its healing balm could end years of suffering. Thus ended the tale of a pair of brothers who learned through suffering that the path to inner peace starts with forgiveness. Their story served as a reminder to their village and anyone who heard it that forgiveness is indeed the only way out of the labyrinth of suffering.